Okay, so as you know, I collect Garfield, but what this is going to be is part of a video of some of my finished works and then also part of my, um, the beginning of my stash. Um, I am having to use my daughter's LED light so that you can see this is my bedroom wall. Um, these are some of my Garfields. These are, these are Garfields that I actually colored with pencils um, and laminated them with my laminator and put them on my wall. So yeah, and there's, there's another one I did. Um, but I'm using the LED light so that you can actually get a better view. I, here's some Garfield cross stitches that I finished. Let's see if I can get a really good view of this. This is crazy. I can't believe I'm trying to do this. It's really high up. Let's see, can you see it? Can you see it really? This is I'll rise, but I won't shine. I just thought that was so cute. That's done on plastic canvas. 14 count. And then this one, let's talk golf, you lie first. Really funny. My ex-husband actually did this one for me. He found the kit. Um, it was a kit and it was done with uh, 14 count plastic canvas as well. And this is the other one I did. I love my cat. But that's a Garfield cross stitch. All right, now on to the little one's room. All right. So here we are in Matson's room. Let's see if I can get this focus better. Um, her room I did in a, an ocean theme from before she was born. This is one of the gifts that I gave her. And it's two dolphins jumping in the moonlight. I just think that is so pretty. Um, it's done on a navy blue background. And that was a kit too. And I'm thinking it was a dimensions kit. Um, let's see, there's one. I had a clock. I'm using the LED light again. She has no windows and it's nighttime, so um, I had a clock customized with her name on it. I had a chart customized with her name on it. Um, and then some of these, I did that in colored pencils and I laminated it. Um, I did that in colored pencils and laminated it. Let's see, there's another one I did laminated it. You can kind of tell because the, you can see where I got tired with the hair where it starts the color starting to fade a little bit. Um, let's say I did that one. Um, I did Sebastian. I did that one. Now these aren't cross stitch but I'm proud of my work on these because I think these colored pencils turned out really good. But anyway that's part of her room. Okay so here is a cross stitch that I did for her and I had found some Finding Nemo material um, and I sewed a border on it and just put it in a basic black frame so she's got Nemo and she's got Dory so I cross stitched that as well and I think those turned out really cute those were little kits <laughs> of course there's Madsen she's gotta say hi um, let's say I did that one to represent me and her, even though he's the daddy, that's me and her. Um, I didn't do all of those. Well, let's see, I think that's it as far as anything that I drew. I think the rest of them are just decals. Yeah, so that's... I want to have to show these. This, this is a picture that my friend Pam took. Um, one of my dearest friends, Pam. Pam. She's in Florida now. Um, she took these pictures for Maddie on a dive that she did. She's in uh, South Florida. Um, but she gave those to me and Maddie when Maddie was little bitty. You can see it's dark in her room. Yay, she's getting ready for bed. Yeah, silly bed. All right, but anyway, um, okay, so there's that, and I will show you the rest later. Will she get her treats? She's trying to give us treats. Last one. Uh oh. Last one. What do you mean, last one? Give her, give her.
Okay, give her five more. Eight, ten. Eight, ten. No, give them to her slow so she can so she can go after them. Don't give it to her. She's gonna scratch you. Let her have it. Matson, give it to her. That's just mean. It makes a cat walk in circle. Is that her last one? Is that the last one? Yeah. Okay. Hey! Hey, darling. Oh. Your mommy's got her treats. She thinks you're going to give her more. Nope, oh, that was it.